My grandmama used to always tell me, when a woman sat on a man's lap, they having sex usually. That's Biggie. We're hearing the allegations with Puffy. I think those are some, some sexual demons. Reggie Wright Jr. has accused Bad Boy Records of being a place of sexual demons. This is Fresh Hip Hop Opinion with your guy Alize. Don't forget to subscribe. So we all know P. Diddy, Puff Daddy, Brother Love has been in a lot of trouble in the last few weeks. Starting with Cassie accusing him of a bunch of sexual offenses where he settled out of court within 24 hours. And she's been smiling ever since. And then since then, Diddy has received a few more lawsuits, accusations, whatever you want to put it down as. And the most damning is the most recent, which is from a female who was at the time 17 years old. And there's actual images with her in the studio. Diddy, in response to that, came up with a statement strongly denying all accusations and accusing all of them of it being a money grab. On top of that, former Bad Boy employees Jeannie Dill, the bodyguard, has been continuously talking crap about Diddy, talking about all the things he's been doing, and that he's a bit zesty, to put it lightly. He continues to make his tirade against Diddy. And then in recent weeks, Mark Curry has really come to the forefront who was an artist at Bad Boy in the early 2000s. He was speaking about Diddy in a, in a bad way before these allegations came out. But since they came out, he's been on every platform talking his talk, man. He can't stop talking. One of the accusations was that they would go to a nightclub and literally spike females' drinks. And then when they like, all mash up, pop pills in their mouth like it was a regular occurrence kind of a bad impression on him for him to be even taking part in that anyway he was trying to make diddy look bad but it also made him look bad he knew what was happening and didn't do nothing about it but reggie wright jr former death row employee he was actually the head of security and then ran the business when suge knight was in jail has come out and he has been speaking on his platform he's been saying that biggie smalls was also into that stuff because there's a picture out there with Biggie with a fan who at the time was 14 years old and the picture was taken in Biggie's condo. My grandmama used to always tell me when a woman sat on a man's lap, they having sex usually. And uh, that's Biggie. We're hearing the allegations with Puffy. I think that was what's going on around there. I think those niggas were some some sexual demons is what I give that was going on around Bad Boy Camp in the 90s. Just from the lawsuits and the statements of two people that was definitely around them as much as they were in the 90s, meaning Gene Deal, Mark Curry. Well, people are saying that she's sitting on his lap, but I believe in the picture it's not clear. He's clearly sitting down but she might be just standing in front of him. But a lot of people say she's sitting on his lap. Let me know in the comments what you think. So Reggie Wright was basically talking about how this sort of thing was common in the 90s a little bit, but it seems like Bad Boy had a bit of a reputation for messing with underage females, just based on all the allegations coming out against Diddy and also this image with Biggie with the young female too. I ain't saying anything about it. That's not my opinion, it's just what he said. I'm just reporting, baby. Don't shoot the messenger. What's also fueled what Reggie Wright is saying is all the rumors about Diddy before all this came out that he was messing with men as well. Allegations that Cassie came out with was that he would want her to have relations with other men while he watched in the corner. People are suspecting that's why he settled out of court so quickly because he was scared that she would reveal much more damning secrets maybe him participating with other men i had to whisper it it's kind of crazy but it's nuts you know just a month ago diddy was diddy he was brother love he was the guy that was maybe people talking about his album was album of the year and then a month later he's got like three or four sexual assault cases against him people revealing all these secrets about him people coming out dissing him and all that man Diddy ain't going to be looked at the same again. I doubt he's going to go to prison though, but his reputation's in the mud. 
But anyway, people, I want to know what you lot think. Do you agree with Reggie Wright Jr. that the bad boy artists in the 90s and 2000s were a bit of sexual demons going after anything and everything moving, even a hole in the wall? And what do you think about Diddy and all these allegations coming out? And what do you think about that Biggie Smalls picture? Is it damning or is that just out of context you don't know what it's about? Let me know in the comments, y'all. Don't forget to like, subscribe, Hit that notification bell. It's fresh hip hop opinion. Peace and love.